Whenever we come here and tell you guys how men have come, some of you used to vex, especially men in our comments. <laughs> Last year, we came here and told you guys, you guys about Peter Doche mm -hmm. and all the statements that he made about made. women, how he literally sees women as objects, and people were vexing. Why are you disrespectful? Blah, 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 blah. Like his respect that we used to eat. But now it has happened. His son has come out after 16 or 17 years of marriage, right? 17 years, yeah. That he has married a second wife mm -hmm. and has a son with his mm -hmm. second wife. With his yeah. first wife, perfectly fine. And yeah. with many children. With four fact, children. He actually came online to say how his marriage is sweet and good mm -hmm. and basically perfect, right? Mm -hmm. So why did you go and marry a second wife? Mm. And... You know, he almost got exposed, right? That's why he yeah, exposed himself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By, what's her name? Just Lover or Gis something. Lover. Yeah. Okay. He exposed himself because he has been hiding it since. Is it today, mm -hmm. my wife? Mm -hmm. He has been hiding it since. I'm sure all this time that his father was talking that thing online. <laughs> of course now. Yes, now. Mm -hmm. now. And now we're even sure he's the only one that he has. Anyways, mm -hmm. we're well, going to dissect all that in a minute. In yeah. In the meantime, Wanello and Ada. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> channel is always linked down, down below. below. Yeah. How did you see this news? Okay, so for those who don't know, okay, if you don't know who this person is, Yul Edoche is Pete Edoche's son. Pete Edoche, the veteran actor, okay? And Yul Edoche is also an actor, and according to the story, according to his own story, he got married at 22 to the love of his life and, he and poor, when he was he poor he didn't have a good job nothing she was just he was struggling and she married him and she built with him and they were married for 17 years mind you they celebrated 17 years anniversary just recently okay i think towards the end of last year rich man because he <laughs> yes sir he became rich, he he became rich. mind you he's an Igbo man who he has three sons so you cannot say it is a boy, boy that is looking for. He has a daughter that is his first child, fine girl. You will not say he's looking for a girl. His wife his is still, still getting married. Yes, now. Thank years. you. His wife is fine, fine hot, hot, slim, beautiful, doing well for herself. To put her has, to put pictures. Yeah. So has her own business, everything. So what was he looking for outside? Is there even any satisfying men? Because, because this thing is becoming like a cause. It's becoming uh, like a sickness. Mm -hmm. What is the need for another wife? Another wife. That same who you are penetrating. Is it's the same, the same, one it's the same thing. It's the same thing. His wife, sorry to say, is even finer. Hotter, exactly. Everything. Four children. Mm -hmm. So, we're going to put pictures of two of them. See, this yeah. is not comprising. We're just saying, because we want to understand what men yeah. want. If a man are watching this video, what do you, you really want? want? Because at the end of the day, many people always, when things like this happen, they either say, oh, the wife did not dress well or she doesn't look good. Or the wife is troublesome. He used his mouth to say she never gave him any trouble. Okay, that was his direct quote. She never gave him any trouble. She never, you know, did anything to I mean, stress him. Yeah, years. that was his own quote. Some people say, oh, she, you have your money. Money stops insult. She has her own money, okay? But do people you know say, mm -hmm. do you know another thing, eh? Knowing the man that raised him, I'm not shocked, okay? Mm -hmm. And also, knowing the man that raised him, I mean, his father, Peter Dote, mm -hmm. who like vex, who like don't vex, he's not somebody that values women. He's no, not... but but you know, eh, I can't, well, I understand where you're going to, eh, yes. but think about it, Peter Dote is even a more popular actor. Why you know my second wife? No, but that's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, yeah, like what we were saying in mm -hmm. our video yesterday, this, some parents are okay with their children selling their body mm -hmm. for money, but they, they don't, they don't, they won't do it, yeah. But it's like, is was he really that good of an example for his son to come out like this? Because for his son to go and pay a bride price, yes, he must have followed. Course, he must have followed. Course, so if he's if he's really against if it, he was really against it. He would advise he would, his son. They yeah. remain girlfriend, but they, you went as far as even marrying marrying wife. wife. And mm -hmm. as an evil person, it's not actually common. Is either exactly. you and your first wife get divorced or something, then you marry again. Or yeah. Then, then the person marry. But you see, one person marrying two wives is it's actually not common. Wife. Yeah. You see practice traditional uh, yeah beliefs, beliefs and all of that, that yeah that. Mm -hmm. but at the end of the day Peter, it doesn't look like somebody that practices on the same <laughs> exactly so how do we even know that that marriage is clipping was good how are you sure that girl was not oppressed no no sure not no no the thing are you sure she doesn't, the, okay the, the, the wife right the yeah, wife the because okay the thing the thing that happened here eh, is that okay according to the story right he was he, okay he the girl the, the wife actually had 
an idea that something was going on, something was fishy. And she asked him, and he said nothing was happening. But you know what kind of thing now? You can't hide it for too long. I mean, you are going out. And apparently, it's not only this one, though. There are so many women, though. Like, of course, he was, it was his normal, like, yeah, it was his normal, said, it was, sure yeah, normal? it was his normal, you know, behavior. Anyway, so, after he got this woman pregnant, she, the wife was still asking, he said nothing was happening. Then, this lover now hinted, that something was going on. That was why the guy quickly went to put so out the story. Found out with us. She found out after us. Oh my god. She found out on Monday. <laughs> like <laughs> why are men stupid? Why? Well not all men. Not all men, but why yeah, are, why why, men why? Dogs? to why me to me like why can't you appreciate good people in your life? Why can't you see something? Why can't you respect? Do you know eh? It's better if, she, if he had told her sins. Yes. Let her, let her be ready for this embarrassment but yeah national, national imagine imagine going to marry somebody and your first wife doesn't know they went to pay they said that they made it a very small event they made sure nobody had phones or whatever whatever that whatever they should try to keep it under wrap it's wrong. wrong okay You're going the extra mile to hide it and i think so i think the reason why he even wants to marry this girl is because he wants to run for president like are you a joker which I, president I, of I, where I, wait you say what Yes, now he wants to run for president now. President of here, of Bollywood. Uh, uh, my dear, I, I have no idea. Pre president of in, in real of life, Bollywood. <laughs> in real life, I'll be in dream. Like, how do you, how do you want to, like, I, I, I okay, well, want... who, who is the girl? What does that have to do okay, with so, the president? You know, uh, maybe he doesn't want it to be a gist that he has children, extramarital affair. He wants to make it look like he actually really married this person. Oh my. Like, like we're supposed to now clap for him and say, "Oh, he did the right thing." So if I try clapping for him, shall we get into that later on? But to me, it's just obvious that you don't love your wife, and you are what you're doing is very terrible. Like no sane human being will see this kind of situation and say, "Oh, uh, it's good." Some people are saying that, shall but to me, it doesn't make sense. Like this guy has a wife, he has children who are old enough. What What are you looking for? I can't even imagine if it was a woman that got pregnant for, for another man. man. No, imagine now. Uh, imagine, just imagine. And everybody who expects that wife to. To be calm, to, to be, be calm, yeah. To, they'll not be saying things like, oh, but it's not the baby's fault. And yes, the baby did not uh. beg to be born. You know, they'll, be, they'll be saying nonsense and expect her to love the child, to accept the child, to accept the wife. Mm -hmm. Women were suffering, and it's so unfair. Like, But you know, another thing I even want to find out, Seth, is this, right? When people are saying things like, Polygamy is not bad because I hear I kind of seen a lot. Polygamy is not bad. Polygamy is not bad. Whatever. Some people say it's even Igbo culture to, to be polygamous. I'm where like, are you? Which where? Are you uh, maybe in the in the 1900s or whatever. Just think that our great great grandfathers did. did and yes, suffered for it. Though. We may not even have rights. And then, suffered for it. Exactly. We may not have rights. Then it's not even only in Nigeria anyway. We may yeah. Not have rights then. So you want us to go back to go back to that? Women were and the thing is this: here. Do you know what? Property. My own self is there. You can marry hundred wives if you want, but it, did your first wife approve? Did you tell her before you were going to marry? her that i might marry more wives so did you even tell her after you married her that there might be more wives in the picture you didn't you didn't even tell her you are going to marry a new wife you just she just found that on the internet online. thank you found on the internet the way the rest of her found that so at the end of the day it is pure wickedness what that guy did there and at the end of the day you see this thing about coming on social media to come and pose as oh yeah this moral upright person and, said, and i love all my children the same. the same i love this one as much as i love my other who asks you who asks you nobody cares nobody cares save that story for your children the ones, that the ones that need that explanation the rest of us don't really care, care? okay and then let's even get into the lady that got pregnant for him right they say she's an actress she had kids before she was married before she had kids but that the husband divorced her because she was you know walking up and down like she was cheating on him or whatever clearly. then of course clearly then now she now ended up with yule doche they met on set and all and all that and all that okay so clearly this woman knew that this man was married and still went there right and then when she now got pregnant According to the story, he wanted her to remove the pregnancy, but she said no, she was going to keep it, you know, that she wanted to keep the pregnancy. So that was why he now had to... Now. Yes, now, of course. That's why he now had to, you know, do something quick, quick, and just go and marry her. So I had to be like, oh, he's a second wife. We all know that this thing was not a... a it wasn't like you went into the relationship trying to marry the lady. It was... A way match. You were cheating on her, which cheating on your wife, and then things now got out of hand. Right. Yeah. And another thing is, eh, why do women disrespect themselves that much? Like, yeah. shame. Like, don't Thank you, have, you. She, she will not even let me approach a married man. Like, don't you have self-worth? I'm telling like, you. Let's, we've talked about the man mm -hmm. now. Yes, he's married. Mm -hmm. 
he has all his own problems. Yeah. But let's not deny the fact that you, the woman too, that is going to this married man, you have a uh-huh. problem. You have a well. problem. You yeah. Value yourself. You mm-hmm. don't see yourself as important enough or valuable enough to find someone that will be your own. Own. Oh, yeah. Do like, why do you feel like attaching yourself to another, another person? Man. Exactly. You know I mean? Like, why do you feel the need? And you know the funny thing, eh? A lot of women say things like. Eh, it's not bad that it's the man that you know took the vows. Me, I even say it too. It's the man that yes, took the vows. He has to do this. But we, as women, too, we we have also have to have self worth, have respect. Have respect. Like when have you, regard for your like at the end of the day, you even have children. Aside the one you just had, now you had children before. Like, can't you respect your children? Let's say the man has already made it. the man is already useless. Dog. You know yes. whatever. Yes. Eh. He has come to approach you. Must must you accept? accept? It's still two adults making. A decision that yeah. will affect their lives mm-hmm. and affect other people's lives. Yeah. So yes, as much as the man is to blame eighty percent because mm-hmm. he's married, warm, blah blah blah. Yeah. As the woman, must you accept? must you accept Can't and set ground rules? Exactly. And as human beings in general, we have to be careful when we are dealing with people who don't have much to lose. You, you are Peter Doche's son. Okay, you have that reputation, you are an actor, you are the more popular one, you are rich, you have a family, you have children, you have a lot to lose. What, what business do you have with Let somebody me like that? You, he's not gonna lose anything. New movie will come out next week, next two months. Next well, season of Nigeria, people will yeah. be praised for this well, action. They, they will actually, no, that people are applauding him already. Oh, say. People are saying, Yes, so yeah, Odogu, Odogu it's, call. it's the fact, okay? Yeah. Nobody will pay, he will not pay the price. But mm-hmm. if anything, his career will go higher. higher. Not the, That's and really sad, now, though. Peter will come and be saying things like women don't have rights. A woman is a man's property. Blah blah. Where is he today? Was he cancelled? No. No, exactly. Is he not still doing well? Mm-hmm. Of course. So like, so, it's, it's a Nigerian thing. We because why? Why was even act like dogs? Yeah. And call women prostitutes and when they when they even do something do slightly minor. Yeah, sli- slightly. Oh, because um, in this person's case, was it not Messi Aigbe? That got married, she became a second wife to somebody. I know how they finished her on the internet. And nobody even talked about, nobody talked about the man or ever. They finished her on the internet, you know. But now that is a man now that is now in the spotlight, everybody's trying to or some people are trying to excuse it and all of that. Why I was even saying be careful about people that have nothing to lose. I remember that story of uh, uh, Mr. Osifo or whatever that meant to gun that they killed now that one children my girl killed. Okay, yeah. Well, uh-huh. yes. It's still that same. Oh. It's still that same with all your big prestige. Yes. You are bringing yourself down to nothing, you know. Yeah. So at the end of the day, men said don't even have self worth. Women too, no self worth. Like all of them just. Oh, they beat each, each other. That's yeah, just the, the matter. Just tired. Ah, it's my just dear. a very nonsense thing to do and yeah. a bad situation to be in mm-hmm. for his wife. I actually yeah. feel bad for the baby. Seventeen whole years. Yeah. Do you know what seventeen years is? I'm telling like you. Like seventeen. Do you know I would have had more respect for the guy if he came out and said. I made a mistake. This happened. This that. This that. This that. I'm he sorry to my wife. To marry the person. Exactly. But coming to Anna, because he came with pride. That's why this is yes. my 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 new child he's and my new wife. He's Nigeria now. He's Nigeria. They will applaud him. Yeah. Nigeria now. Or God boss. Uh, yes, wife. boss. Eh. Uh, uh, they will applaud him. Now man, you be. To applaud to them. Thank you. Now man, you be. Oh, Lord, <laughs> man. So I'm just going to end it here, please. Yeah. We're going to uh, another video is coming up soon. Yeah. Because a lot of people seem to have something to say about yeah. the matter. So I'm going to dissect that in a minute. Exactly. So see you guys then. Yeah.